Hello, Dude, welcome back to Game Blue. Nathan's got something to say. What? Oh shit. Eloquent. <laughs> wow, that ball did not move for a second there. Mm. Even though like four people hit it. I like it when balls don't move. <sighs> That's very off putting. Yeah, I know. Just like your face. Yeah. Now you're throwing me off fucking idea now. <laughs> yeah, I tend to do that, don't I? Yeah, because you're gross. And you're talking about gross things. I do, don't I? And you just you just sit there and let me do it. <laughs> that's the worst part. You're an enabler. <laughs> oh, hey, or you yeah. start laughing at something that's completely innocent. What your grandma? It <laughs> <laughs> totally innocent. You know whether they're like blaming off of him. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> but yeah. Anyway. I mean, I don't know what's so funny about that. I'm sure she's a fine lady. Yeah, I don't know why I laughed <laughs> you just so hard at that. It was, it was just... Like, my brain didn't even go anywhere. It was just like a weird thing to say. So I was watching my brand. <laughs> <laughs> full, full stop. <laughs> it really felt like that. <laughs> I think you watch it back and it was like, fuck, there was nothing funny about that. What's all yeah, about? you guys made fun of me the way I said murdered soul suspects. <laughs> No, but you and, didn't actually say that. And I've been listening to it. I say it fine. So uh, I don't think you did. So I think you're just screw like you guys. Out, I'm going home. Huh? Oh, fine. Go home. Get out of my house. Okay. <laughs> End recording. Uh, anyway, yeah. um, End friends <laughs> Yeah, I gotta find you that gift that um, friggin' Gil? Star Trek thing. Did you say Gil? Did you? Did, yeah. did you? Did you say steak? Oh. Um, so your brain goes from old <laughs> women to have sex with to yeah. steak. Um, it's from... The Deuce Bigelow. Yeah, that's it. What a terrible film. Wow. <laughs> that was shit. I have not thought about those movies uh, for a while. What's that, what's that guy's name? So, uh, Rob Schneider. Rob Schneider. I just like in the second one how he throws a midge out the window into There's the water. There's a second one? Yeah. And all he is... And you know what? Better than the first. Really? Yeah. Rob Schneider. derp 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 <laughs> He's a stapler. <laughs> Rope Snyder is a carrot. Yeah. And derpy derpy dibbly derpy derpy derp. derp. But no, it's like, he throws a midget out the window into a pool and all he goes, ah! <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, that was kind of a cheap shot, but it was also kind of funny. Yeah. yeah. Robert, Rob Snyder, Robert Snyder, <laughs> kind of a cheap shot. Yeah. <laughs> I made him sound really fancy by calling him Robert. Yeah. Or Roberto. He's got, um, Oh, is that on Netflix? I think so. Yeah. I I I've need to watch that, don't I? Um, and I, no, it's interesting because... Is it? Um, what, him and his wife, like him and his wife, and like it's their family. Oh, like everyone yeah. plays like an awful version of themselves. Oh, really? And like, because, have you seen it on Game Games? Because no. Aaron, one of the people on Game Games, Aaron, yeah, yeah. Like, Oh, I've seen a little bit. complains bit. about it on one of the episodes. Like, says, I've watched this show and I have no idea what the appeal is. I hate everyone on the show. Like, yeah. every character is an arsehole. I don't understand. Yeah. And Rob Schneider and his wife ended up being on the show with them on Game Rooms. <laughs> oh, and they just, okay. Like, talked about the show. Like, oh. While playing Mortal Kombat. <laughs> <laughs> and his wife owned them all. Really? <laughs> yeah, crushed them like you'd say. It was great. Oh, out of the game. Okay. Yeah. So, so I'll be better than, like, like, defending that show. Oh, yeah. No. yeah. They just like talked about it. Oh, okay. You know, yeah. they both seem very nice. Like civilizable. Yeah, I'm sure he's a really nice person in yeah. real life. He's just not funny. <laughs> His movies aren't funny. No, he's not funny. You're like, like Adam Sandler. Apparently, he's a really nice guy, but like, his I can't films... really take him seriously because he was like in a serious film, and it was just like, eh, I've seen you yeah. want to fuck a post. I think yeah. that they both get more hate than they really. Do. Yeah. Because like some of their shit is just terrible. They deserve but some to of their die. Stuff is fine. Yeah. Like, have I've... you ever watched Hotel Transylvania? Yes. It's all them guys. Is oh, it? Yeah. Well, that, that was like a, a place record. That was a kids' movie, so that doesn't really count. <laughs> but like, everyone's like, "Oh, why would anyone want to watch Grown Ups?" I thought that was a perfectly acceptable movie. Yeah. Uh, like, I, it wasn't I don't. Great, uh, yeah, I don't hate it. I really have nothing to say about it. I think it's just because on the internet you either love something or you hate it. Yeah. You know, there's no middle ground for anything. It's never enough to say like, "Oh." It's just okay. 
Yeah. You know, like this new Ghostbusters film. Apparently, like it's just okay. Yeah. And everyone's like, no, you have to hate it. No, I've like looked at reviews and stuff, and they say it's absolute trash. Oh, and, like, I mean, I've seen the interviews where um, Bill Murray and the um, other guy, Dan Aykroyd, talking yeah. about it, and they're just they're saying it's like, yeah, it's really good, but you can just see in their eyes this pain. They, they kind of, yeah, they kind of have to okay. defend like, it. I've been... had that since Ghostbusters 2. <laughs> Ghostbusters 2 was a travesty of a film. Oh, is it bad? Yeah. Have oh, you seen yeah. it? Uh, it? Oh, now you've no, seen it? It's, I can't It's remember. funny. It's practically because, just um, the first one. Yeah, it's <laughs> the same, like, arc like almost down to the wire of the yeah. first one oh, okay. except just not good at all oh like uh, Hangover 2 like how it's just the same film yeah <laughs> it's exactly like that yeah <laughs> Hangover racist edition uh, I feel like the first one's pretty racist also um have you seen the third one? oh uh, yeah is That's everyone cute. else here aware of how Dad Aykroyd went completely fucking insane yep oh uh, no do tell like that uh there's that like five second clip of him saying like I don't believe we'll ever be contacted by intelligent alien life, particularly after 9-11. What? <laughs> and it's just like, whoa, okay. Uh, how are those two things related? <laughs> <It's a laughs> like, good what does that mean? No, I, like, I know, sorry, I just kind of want to dissect that statement. <laughs> yeah, like, like, I... So the aliens would see 9-11 and go, like, oh, no, we, we can't contact, yeah, we can't do any of this. I don't know. What does that mean? I don't know. I want to ask him. Do you think he has a Twitter? Probably. <laughs> uh, we're on the same wavelength. Yep. <laughs> I am opening Twitter. If he does, like, you have to ask him. I'll do it in my account. Like, um... How like, do you spell Dan Aykroyd? D-A-N? I know that part. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, A-C-K... I think it has R-Y. A-Y-K. Oh, oh, oh is it? Y-D. Let's try Dan. It should come up. Yeah, Dan. <laughs> But yeah, it's like, um, have you ever watched Casper, the movie, like the there's live a, movie? Yeah, it's like a real, I, I'm sorry, live action. Yeah, he actually plays a Ghostbuster in it, and he's only in it for like three seconds. Whoa. When did that come out? That's already old for me. Yeah, I wrote a scene the original Ghostbusters by That's what ruined your childhood. That actually happened? I don't remember that. I, I can't remember Ghostbusters. Dan, I've such a beloved culture figure. Why didn't Blues Brothers 2000 make a billion dollars? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Whoa, because shot because Blues Brothers 2000 is really desperate. <laughs> oh, yeah. That's it's really sad. Kind of a Yeah. I just realised we had... Yeah. <laughs> What's that? Reading okay. stuff. No, sorry, I mean, does he have an account? Not the oh, people bitching about him. Like it. Oh, that's a shame. Does he have like a, a PO box that we should write a letter to? <laughs> yes, you stink. And just write, Dear Dan Aykroyd. What the fuck? <laughs> what does your 9 11 comment mean? No, seriously. What, what did you mean by that? Yeah, like I. And, no, and it's then... just like, Dear Dan Aykroyd. Dear Dan Aykroyd. Dude. <laughs> that's it. Uh, P.S. Please like and subscribe to the channel. <laughs> okay, uh, there's a tweet here that says, yeah. Just saw somebody complain a Bill Murray Dan Aykroyd franchise has been recast with Saturday Night Live actors. Full story, bro. Yeah, because they're all Saturday Night Live. Oh, right, Live I was going to say, yeah, like, that's the joke. Okay. Yeah. Are they all from Saturday Night Live? Yep, every Who, single the, one. The girls. Nah, nah, everyone in the original one. Oh, the original, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 I knew that. Like, that's what they were complaining about, that they were all Saturday Night Live. Like, Saturday Night Live. People? Yeah. That's Sorry, Whereas the, the original the ones were set. Yeah. Because yeah. Jim Belushi and Adam Sandler, them lot, they got started on Saturday Night Live. Adam Sandler wasn't on Saturday Night Live. Yeah, he was. What's he got started? No, I want to get, um... Yes? Let me check how we are for time. Okay, we've got a couple minutes. I want to get the Dan Aykroyd quote for you. But, um... <laughs> Please do. A lot of our imports yeah. come from other countries. <laughs> No, not George Bush quotes. <laughs> George Bush waved at Stevie Wonder. <laughs> it's just like, that motherfucker waving at me. <laughs> uh, oh no. Georgie B. 
You're awesome. Okay. Uh, Are you still um, trying to find it? Yeah, I found it. someone else? Oh, did someone else said, someone else in like the um, American government said, where would it, where would we be, where would we be without this grand, great land of ours? What? What would America be without this great land of oh, ours? Yeah. It was just like, what? <laughs> um. If you go to Neverland, it says you must be this high to ride my ball. <laughs> you like all alone again. <laughs> What the fuck is going on? What are you looking at? Oh, uh, okay, here's the quote. Because they don't want anything to do with us. I don't think we will ever have a formal relationship, a formal contact with any alien species out there, especially after 9-11, when we broke our toys in the sandbox. <laughs> if they were observing that, goodbye human race. <laughs> but, like, what's he saying? <laughs> that, that, no, no, sorry. That, 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 sorry, these theoretical aliens, like, they witness World War Two, and, you know, just mass genocides... And what, they're cool with that, I but 9-11, that's where they draw yeah. the line. 9-11, when we broke our toys in the sandbox. <laughs> and like, the article like goes on about how uh, like, he thinks aliens would be in violation of, or like there have been vi uh, aliens in violation of Title 18, Section 1201, Paragraph A of the United States Code, about like, you know, whoever unlawfully like, seizes or kidnaps or holds people for ransom. And like, it's about, about, like, he thinks like they'd be violating the law because of animal crimes. <laughs> like, what the fuck? We need to arrest them. <laughs> God, shit, holy shit. Where, when is that article from? Oh, that's a reason? I think. Really? Yeah, May 12, 2010. Oh. And it, like, links to a couple of YouTube videos, which apparently have been deleted because they weren't locked. <laughs> Sorry, can I make a plea to everyone? Can someone just go to his house and just <laughs> check on him? Just yeah, see if he's, he's okay. okay, yeah. I'm sure we'd have heard about him if he died. Would we have heard? Yeah. I feel like if Dan Aykroyd died, that would just kind of slip under the radar. Nathan just said that he's been, like, making promos for the new Ghost Ghostbusters film. I almost said Ghostbusters. <laughs> Ghostbusters. <laughs> I don't know what that means. Oh. Okay, we are out of time. And I'm kind of relieved. <laughs> okay. Oh, bye, everyone. Bye.